My name is Mark Bamuti Joseph. I'm the Vice President of Social Impact and the Artistic Director of Cultural Strategy at the Kennedy Center and one of the architects of the Cartography Project. Well, the first iteration of the Cartography Project, it was done during the pandemic. Um, so there was a lot of limitations there and, and while it was successful, it did limit, I think, some of the composers and, and having to come to D.C. rather than um, being in their own element. Seattle is such a big part of my creative identity. Um, someone deemed my music hologram funk. I love the fact that like things aren't congruent because then that's how we like that's how we shake things up. And I love shaking up the boat. It's about stripping away what we think is our identity or what we've been told is our identity, and then allowing something something to be birthed out of that. There's this one part in the in the cello, and from my mind that is 100% influenced by tubas in New Orleans marching bands, because marching band here is it's like a giant thing, huge, right? Little kids start from this this age, right? And so, but that's that's to your point of the Louis, Louis Armstrong, the music culture is so, is so embedded. It just, I can't help but put that into the music. So like the cello is playing this very, to me, rhythmic thing, but all that is is just, just something that I would hear in New Orleans, case closed. And like the chords and stuff, all that little crunchy, like it's just, it's just the sounds of the city, you know? In social impact, we say our, our equity is our North Star. We talk about um, a culturally equitable future. Um, our desire isn't to mimic classical norms and put them in brown face or black face or to put them in the bodies of black or brown musicianship. Um, diversifying the norms of um, classical music isn't just about minoritized bodies, it's in this case, um, an inquiry as to what constitutes classicism. 